Let's learn how we can use a seamless texture within Corel Photo Paint. The first thing I need to do is create a new file. So we'll select File, New. I want it to be 2048 pixels square, and you'll see it remembered that from the last file I created, and it's going to have a white background color. We'll go ahead and say OK, and it fills up our screen with that file. You'll see the scroll bars indicate there's a lot more that we are not seeing. Now to fill this, we're going to go to Edit, Fill. We've got several icons right here. We want the one labeled Bitmap Fill, so I'll click on that. It's remembering the last fill I used, so let's click on Edit, and you get this dialog box. I'm going to choose Load, and now I'll see all kinds of different fills. I'm going to choose one here called Sun Faded Checker, and I'm going to choose 512 pixels square. If I click on Preview, I can actually see what it looks like. Now this is from the Textures Unleashed Volume 1 collection, so if you like these fills, you know where you can find it. We'll go ahead and click on Open, and you'll see a sample of it there. We're using the original size. You'll remember this was 512 pixels square, so that's exactly what it's going to be in our file. We can change the origin, we can skew it and rotate it. We're just going to click OK. We see a detailed version of the texture here and a preview of the entire file at the top. We'll click on OK, and there you see exactly what it looks like, and we can scroll down so you can see even more. Because it is a seamless texture, you won't see where one tile stops and the next one starts. That's the whole benefit of using that. Now with your Corel Draw and or Corel Photo Paint package, you were supplied with several bitmap seamless textures. Keep in mind, these are 320 by 240 pixels and they are only 8-bit color. Many of the files you'll work with in Photo Paint are 24-bit colors. So you're not really getting the most out of the file if you only have 8 bits. That means only 256 colors. So you might want to look to get some textures elsewhere and we highly recommend the Textures Unleashed Collection.